Hey, my name's Stephen Mills. Uh, this is my team here, Michael Lim and John Stout, uh, project manager uh, in charge of physics homework, uh, parts procurement, etc. We worked on uh, Project Mantis this semester for our senior design project. Basically, it's, um, it's a mouse, it's a wireless mouse that gets its power from an inductively coupled coil within the mouse pad. So you don't have to have any batteries in your mouse, and you don't have to worry about your batteries dying on you at any time. Essentially what we did is we used the MOS inverter driven by a square wave to send an alternating current through our resonant coil in the mouse pad. We tuned this to resonate at around uh, 40 kilohertz and likewise uh, put a secondary coil inside the mouse also tuned to resonate around 40 kilohertz. After that we have a rectifier circuit and a Zener diode to supply a steady 3 volts to the mouse at all times. We ran our primary circuit off of a 12 volt wall wart. We had originally hoped to run off of USB power, but it turned out we weren't able to get quite enough power transfer with a limited amount of time that we had to work on optimizing our circuit. You can see a quick demonstration here. Hopefully you can see on the camera there that the cursor is indeed moving around. We can click here and everything works fine. You'll notice that if you lift the mouse up off the mouse pad, it stops working as you get a couple inches off because you're not getting enough magnetic flux through your secondary coil. An interesting thing that we noticed here when we set up, we set our mouse pad down on this metal table and suddenly our project didn't work anymore. It turns out that the metal was acting as a core for what we have here as an air core transformer and basically soaking up all of our power. It took us a while to figure that out. Um, but just to show you, so you know I'm not a scam artist, no batteries inside the mouse. And when I place it back on the mouse pad, you can see the mouse working again. Would you like to add anything, gentlemen? Okay, perfect job. All right. Thank you very much.